In my fucking room! What? Alright. Ah! <laughs> Once upon a time- Okay, my cat is back. Once upon a time, there was a fish. And this fish lived in a big ocean. And there were big animals. But this wasn't just any animals. These were dinosaurs. There was a fish with a long neck that could swim. One day, this fish went to his shore and he looked up on land and he saw dinosaurs. And these dinosaurs were walking, eating from the grass and the tall trees. And they had long necks too. <laughs> anyway, there were a lot of dinosaurs. And this fish, he wanted to be like them. He wanted to walk on the soil, the sand. He wanted to play in the grass and eat from the yummy leaves. The yummy leaves. <laughs> he wanted to be like these dinosaurs. One day, he started a tradition. He would go on shore and go as far up on shore as he could. Even if that meant going on land. And he'd stay there for five seconds each day. And the tide would come and take him away. <laughs> but he never gave up. He just sits. He just stayed on the side. Take me away. But that didn't matter for him. He was determined. He did this until he died. <laughs> but he left a legacy behind for his kids and the many <laughs> And then generations, oh they would all go on shore and stay on land for five seconds. Eventually, after 50 generations, this little fishy, he went on land, and for the first time in 50 generations, he sprouted legs. <laughs> <laughs> this motherfucker just really said, <laughs> And he was in shock. He was like, there's no way this just happened to me. This little fishy's name was Bob. Bob, he made history. Through 50 generations, he made his great, 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 great. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> but he made them proud. He made his, all his brothers and sisters proud. He walked up farther into shore and he finally touched grass. The first fishy <laughs> to touch grass. He took a deep breath and poof, his gills were gone. And he took a deep breath. <laughs> And it was wonderful. He was so proud that he continued walking. But then, out of nowhere, a T-Rex came in. Stormed <laughs> up to him. But this was no ordinary T-Rex. He was a nice T-Rex. He asked little fishy, or Bob, Hey, can I lend you a hand with anything? And Bob looked up to him and said, Wow! Would you look at that? <laughs> He was like, that's so magnificent. And the T-Rex is, what is? He's like, you're so big. He's like, well, so yeah. Cool. <laughs> right. I'm a T-Rex, obviously. He's like, I want to be like you. And the T-Rex is, well, let me give you a little helping hand in evolution, my guy. <laughs> and the, the little fishy was, how could you do that? And he's like, well... Do you look in the sky? Do you want to be in the clouds? And the fishy was like, the clouds? I've never even dreamed of that before. Mr. T-Rex was like, well, you made it on land. Why can't you be the first fish slash thingy, whatever the fuck you are, <laughs> to be up in the clouds? And Bob was like, oh, I really like that. So, as gentle as a T-Rex can be, he picked him up with his mouth hold up, and hold up, hold up, hold up. launched him. Bob was flying for the first time in ever. The fish was flying. But then what must come up must come down. <laughs> but it's okay. Bob lived. He 
bounced off a mushroom and safely <laughs> landed into a <laughs> pile of leaves. Bob Lindy is like, wow, that was amazing. So, he continued on with his journey. He walked through the plains, the grass, the hills, the mountains. Plateau. And he eventually came to a cave in the mountains. There, he found something so extraordinary that he had no words. Besides, wow! You he came across there. what is known as a monkey. Oh, <gasps> The monkey. Bob was so amazed. He's like, wow! What are you? And the monkey said, <laughs> well, <laughs> I'm a monkey. <laughs> My oh, name is Maverick, by girlfriend. the way. <laughs> hey, there's no here. racism in this story. Then they became friends. Monkey told him, Bob, all about how he came to be a monkey. And Bob was amazed. He was like, wow, can I be like you one day? And Maverick was like, well, yeah, Wasn't maybe through a few generations, yeah, <laughs> eventually you will. Bob was so excited. So, Maverick arranged a plan for them. They were going to travel to the jungle. Mysterious, spooky place. <laughs> so, they traveled to the jungle. And in the time it took them to get there, they were best friends. One of the most wonderful friends that you could ever meet. When they got to the jungle, they came across another weird, extraordinary thing. It was a human. Maverick and Bob were so confused. Like, what the <laughs> heck are you? Like, well, I'm a human. Through generations, I was a monkey. Then, I became a caveman. But then they died. But I'm human now. And through generations, you will too. <laughs> Bob and Maverick looked at each other and they're like, Wow, that is amazing. <laughs> but then, out of nowhere, a saber-toothed tiger came and ate Maverick. <laughs> so heartbroken. <laughs> Bob cried, and the only comfort was a human. Sushi time. But <laughs> Bob had only one hope: the human. He hoped he could become best friends with them. Oh, so, God. <laughs> so right there on the spot where the saber-toothed tiger was still eating Maverick, Bob and the human became friends. <laughs> the human was on a mission to find another human for some other reason we don't know about that <laughs> to continue the race of the humans actually because <laughs> i just figured that out anyway <laughs> my dingo swing the human asked if bob can accompany <laughs> him and bob was like well i got no other option let's go so they traveled far and wide but then the human invented Glass bowl. I got one right here. <laughs> the human did something horrible. He put water in the glass bowl and he put Bob in it. And through time, Bob was stuck in there. And sadly, he lost his ability to walk, <laughs> and breathe the fresh air, <laughs> and, t and he longed for the grass again. But he was now a fish. <laughs> a glass bowl. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Follow me on Twitch, X or X. Fifty generations? One fishy. <laughs> One little fishy, he went on land. And he... <laughs> I'm laughing. I'm sorry, I can't. <laughs> okay, good to you. Hey, tell me when you're ready. <laughs> Alright, I'm ready, I'm ready. Okay, this little- <laughs> Great, 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 great. great. on and on and on. And on. <laughs> they went through Egypt. Egypt was back then in the Panama, I don't know. No. No. <laughs> oh shit. No. Never mind. They went through Bions. Wait, 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 wait. Did you call Pangea Panema?
You said ten. anyway. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The fish found the monkey in the cave, and the man in the jungle. <laughs> Caveman, it goes in the cave. <laughs> but it wasn't a caveman. Caveman died. He was a human. <laughs>